to an ABC 21 follow up yesterday. We introduced you to Janine Goodwin, who shared a story of heartbreak. Scammers tricked her out of her life savings of $1,300. Well, today, many of our viewers stepped up to help her out. ABC 21's Corinne Rose has the story. It feels like I'm in a dream, but you don't know. I feel like just like a huge burden is off my shoulders and I can breathe. And I'm just so thankful. Janine Godwin says in less than a day, her life has completely turned around. I didn't do it for the money. I just didn't want nobody else to get hurt. So this is all like a total shock to me. We met Janine Monday when she came to us to share her story of being scammed so that it wouldn't happen to anyone else. She lost her life savings of $1,300 and more in an internet scam. I don't want nobody to go through that again. Godwin told us she'd responded to a Facebook ad claiming to pay her $500 a month for six months if she would allow her car to be wrapped in a Budweiser logo. After a series of cashing checks and sending money orders, her credit union told her a few days later that it appeared the entire ordeal had been a scam and that she needed to pay the bank back about $3,000. We did try to advise and put some check holds on, but with the type of check it is and with a customer in good standing, uh, the internet scammers knew that that check hold was going to fall off before we got a notice back that the check was no good. The president of Fort Financial Credit Union tells us after seeing our story, people walked in Tuesday morning and anonymously donated enough money to pay off what Godwin owed. We had employees and community people that contacted us and said, you know, they felt felt bad for the situation and, you know, they were able to raise money and make deposits and you know, the, the amount of money that was taken from her was actually paid back. The loan is paid in full. I don't have to worry about making payments anymore. Oh, I want to thank you guys so much. I want to thank everybody who has helped me and donated. And God will bless you. He will bless you just like he blessed me. Not knowing that would happen, one of our longtime viewers was so moved by Godwin's story that she set up a GoFundMe account to help her. She was older and they took advantage of her. And she's not that much older than I am. And the point that she lost everything that she had. We will make sure that money goes directly to Godwin's accounts. In less than a day, generous people have paid off Godwin's loan, replenished her savings account, and added more in case she needs it. You guys have changed my life. You just literally have changed my life. And I'm so thankful. Corinne Rose, ABC 21. Fort Financial Credit Union is accepting donations on Godwin's behalf. The GoFundMe account set up to help her is still active, but it will likely be closed this evening. You can find a link to it on our website, WPTA21.com.